Masih lagi ya? Masih ada. Insyaallah. Ah okey, tapi kalau tahun lepas Mak Adam menang tau. Bayangkan dia bukan pelawak tapi dia menang. Ha. Alhamdulillah. Hmm. <laughs> I can hear the Filipino accent a little bit. <laughs> he can't say that word though. Bulan tiga. Yeah. Okay. Insha Allah bulan tiga. Oh, I envy him. He could speak Malay so well. Oh my God. Kita cerita sikit lah moment sewaktu AJL yang keenam. Wow. Mark Adam, dude, teach me. Since we are brothers, as you know, Filipino descent, you're you're Filipino by blood, so. Teach me. And he also speaks uh, the same language as me, guys, because he's also from Cebu, where I'm from right now, where I'm living. I love his new hair, actually. New hairstyle. It's clean. So this lady is. Uh, did she back earlier? Oh, definitely. Oh yes, that is true. He makes us proud. Can you guys tell me who she is? This lady right here. Oh, ah, that is why. Cause she looks so familiar. I just don't want to say the name because I'm not really sure. She looks so pretty, still, still. Ella, much respect to you. I adore you, I adore your voice. She didn't age, are you kidding me? Look at her, what is... What is the secret, guys? Zana Zen, I know she's, she's older, but she still looks so beautiful and so young. Oh my gosh, so Diana Faiza and Nur Faiza and Hayel. Come on, come on. Lots of people shouting. Safin and Nura, shout out to you. I know you're loving this.
those intricate details that will live for that. Yes. Okay, it's raining. I <laughs> love it. Is that real water? This is different. Lots of details. when they were doing the runs and the melismas that was hard because it's all synchronized so well and it also has the belting um, part to it which is really good and also the tone of the two singers are really good oh my goodness they are one of the strongest contestants uh, contenders in this in this um, whole competition so yes are they gonna announce the winners tonight as well, or or some other time? Okay, so let me tell you guys uh, my favorites in any order. Order. I love. Um, I, I will only choose three that I really think are strong um, um, contenders. A lot of them are actually really good, but I need to, to choose my top three. So I would choose Hael Hosaini and Diana Fraser's performance. Also, Siti Nur Diana and uh, Jacqueline Victor, and also Siafina, Siafina, right? The dude with the uh, glasses. So, three of them. And next to that, if, if I will be choosing my top five, is Siti Sarah and um, I would I would choose Misha Omar and also Ada Jawari. <laughs> There's six of them. <laughs> It's so difficult, but Misha Omar probably is, is, is a little bit um, higher than Ara Johari. The fact that she connected more and her performance was, uh, was, was really intense. And she even gave a better performance than Sidi Sara, I guess. So Misha Omar is, is also right, right um, after my top three. That was really um, a very good performance. By the way guys, that is just my opinion and it doesn't affect this competition or it should not affect you in any way because that was just me. I know we all have different um, um, perceptions and um, types of, of music we want to listen to and styles, so that was just my, my opinion. But again, I would also want to point out that, um, again, Kai Bahar did a great job. He just had a, a, a little slippage at the part when, she, when he did the soprano voice. Hael Hosaini's performance as a soul performer was also really good. 
His tone was really crisp and his low notes were really impeccable. Also, I want to point out um, the performance of, uh, of the, the three girls, the fam. That was also commendable because that was difficult. It was an upbeat song. They were, they were dancing and they keep the harmonies um, tight. So kudos to you girls. And uh, what did I forget, guys? Um, Hakim Rusli. Hakim Rusli did a great job. The fact that he is young. Same with uh, Ismael, Izani, and the, the girl was also good. Um, I love their piece because it's, it's jolly, it's, it's a good vibes um, performance. And they didn't disappoint me. I mean, they did a great job. Being in this finals itself is already an achievement for them. Being that young, they still got a lot of years to improve their voices. And I could only imagine, like, after 10 years, they'd be really great, great, great singers. Along with uh, the levels of the younger Faiza and you know, also Shamel, dude, what is wrong with you? I, until now, I couldn't fathom how he is maintaining that raspiness and at the same time doing all those acrobats. And he's dancing in this video. I know he's really good in ballads, but he proved to us that he could also do upbeat songs with his own style. And I would like to commend you on that, dude. What else? Um, the duet of, of the new singer for me and uh, the female and the male singers. Um, the duet, I forgot their names. They were also good. The only comment is is the dude was keeping it at this uh, level. Like he was really calm, even at the until the end of the song, which uh, I wish, I hoped he, he put a little bit of, of power so that he could match the, the intensity that the girl or the woman, the female singer was doing. But all in all, they did a great job because their performance was really clean and they looked so neat. That suit of the dude was really good. And the gown of the girl was similar to Zayana Faisa's gown, I guess. Like when